Exercise 27, Working with Bookmarks, part of the Word 2007 Core Prep Guide, brought to you by Shift Key Solutions. In this exercise, we're going to be talking about bookmarks and how to insert a bookmark and go to a bookmark. So, first thing we want to do is scroll down to page 2 and find the title Public Safety. I'm going to click just in front of that line. From there, I'm going to go to my Insert tab, and here in my Links group, I'm going to find the Bookmark button. So I click this, and it opens up my bookmarks. Here's a list of bookmarks that are currently within this document. Now, I can sort these by name or location. If I sort it by name, it'll be alphabetically listed. If I want to know what the location of these are within my document, which one comes before which, I'll click Location, and I'll see that this is the order in which the bookmarks appear within my document. This would be the first one, second one, third one, and fourth one within my document. Well, I want to add a bookmark here to public safety for convenience sake and be able to get to it quickly. So with my insertion point here, I'm going to come up to the name, bookmark name, and I'm going to type public safety. And then I'll click add. And when I do, I'll now have a bookmark here next to public safety. Next, let's do a control home to take our insertion point back to the beginning of our document. And let's come back to bookmarks. And I'll see that, indeed, we did add a bookmark for public safety. Our exercise tells us to go to the Diagnose and Treatments bookmark and click Go To. When I do, my insertion point takes me right to that bookmark area. I'm going to click Close and here I am. Now, with my insertion point blinking there, we're going to do a little modification to, to this paragraph. And what we're going to do is we're going to come to our Home tab, and here in our Paragraph group, I'm going to click the Line Spacing drop-down. And I want to change the line spacing from 1.15 to 1. And I can see that it modified it slightly, but that's the change and modification we wanted to make. Next, I'm going to click Save. And that saves my work. Well, that was really easy. That concludes exercise 27, working with bookmarks. Thanks for joining me. Next will be exercise 28, working with comments.